Wait, is that Oliver Penmore? If Lizette's looking for a new protege, then maybe he can make an introduction. Well, if it isn't the crown jewel of New York City socialites, Avery Gilligan. I dabble a little bit in design myself, and she's my idol, and I thought maybe you can make an introduction. I think you're much more suited to courthouses and congressional meetings. If you can't find a way to get into the board's good graces, you are risking losing the family's stake and control of the company. How exactly am I supposed to impress the board? Date someone more respectable for once. I have a proposition for you. So you want to pretend date so you can get good press out of it? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> oh, you were being serious. Y yeah, no. I can get you in front of Lizette. You start Monday. So what's the plan? Well, one of the benefits of constantly being surveilled by the paparazzi is I know all their hiding spots. Hey, come on, guys, what's it going to take to make you just get lost? Guess who will leave? Right. Yeah. Um, uh, yeah. Uh, Renee Samaritan is exactly the type of politician this family should align with. My mother got me a job working for a very impressive candidate for Senate. I thought you wanted to be in fashion. I don't know. Everyone to work. It started as a PR relationship. Now I don't even know what it is. Real life feelings from a made up situation. Exactly. I have some information about Oliver that might be of interest. I, I don't understand how the press found out. I, I, I was honest with Renee this morning. This is everything that my family has built. How, how could you do this to me? One thing I did take away from my relationship with Avery Gilligan is that I don't want this company to be run solely for the purpose of profits. The tabloid said it was all a ruse, but I know you well enough to know that's not the whole truth. I did have feelings. Do. I should have told you this weeks ago, but our relationship wasn't pretend for me. I'm in love with you, Avery Gilligan. I'm in love with you too, Oliver. Um...